Welcome back, everybody, to Gold Rush. I'm an old guy gaming, and we are going to go get ourselves a, a large fuel tank today. Um, this is just about full. I had to uh, re put some more fuel in that this morning. Uh, so the first thing we're going to do is go check our gold prices here for today and see what they are. So, yeah, they're still at 1190 Okay, so... Uh, I don't think we have any new workers, but let's double check. Yeah, nobody's here either. Okay. So the plan is uh, to go get that new fuel tank, fill her up, and then come back and start digging. Uh, so if you didn't catch yesterday's episode, we basically moved our operation uh, further out. I did have it back kind of behind those trees to start with. Uh, but as I continue to you know dig this out and move that way, I moved all of the... Uh, equipment in the uh, corner over there so we got that done and we should be ready to go um, with today's mining so I'm just gonna let that um, well you know what it's almost done so I'm just gonna wait for this to finish so I can turn this off and not waste the fuel and then I think what I'll do is I'll take the water tank back and get it positioned and hooked up and then I will meet you guys in town uh, for the purchase of our new fuel tank. So I will see you guys in town. All right, here we are at the warehouse. So what we are after is this guy here. Mobile fuel tank. And it looks like it already comes with a gas nozzle, so... And it, its own fire extinguisher, too. What do you know? Okay. Let's order that. Costs us uh, 3800 bucks and change. And I guess that's all we need, uh, other than the fuel it itself, of course. Uh, so let's head over here and purchase that. There it is. Okay, let's take it over to the gas station and get her filled up. This is going to be expensive. <laughs> Boy, is this ever going to be expensive. But hey, this fuel should last us for a very long time before we have to come back to town. And you know, honestly, I, I still don't know why my, whoops, my vehicles are not using gas, unless it's because I'm on the tutorial, but... That doesn't make a lot of sense either because the tutorial, you know, has parts breaking down and everything else is using gas. So I'm wondering if it's maybe a bug or something. I don't know. Uh, but anyway, there's our fuel tank. Look at that thing. That's cool. All right. So let's take it down to the gas station and get some fuel in it. All right, so before I forget, let's get these jerry cans filled back up too. It's too far. Oh, okay, here. Let's just grab those out of here. All right, here we go. This is going to be expensive. Almost $2,000. There we go, though. It's full. It should, whoops, just open the lid on that. Should keep us from having to come back here uh, for quite some time, actually. Okay, let's head back to the uh, uh, the claim and get the mine in here. I'm going to stop off at the bank real quick just to check one more time. Uh, check the price, that is. Yeah, 1189 It's going up a little bit, but not enough yet for me to want to sell what we have so 
we're just going to keep working and uh, building this gold up until we can get a good price. A good price uh, at present is basically 12, 1200 or higher. That's that's kind of what I'm my my lower limit is. Whether or not it it can get significantly higher than that, and how long it takes, I don't know. But right now, you know, I just want to <coughs> I want to get to that 500k mark so we can get to the tier three in the tutorial. And the only reason I'm doing the tutorial um, at this point is just because I still don't necessarily know everything that needs to happen at tier three, and I'm sure I could figure it out, but I'd rather just go through the tutorial, and that way I can say I did it, and then after that, you know, we're on our own. If we ever do, like, another season, then uh, unless they make, you know, some major changes to the game, uh, I probably wouldn't do the tutorial again. All right, we are here. So, does this require a, a a motor of some sort? That ladder's really weird, man. Or does it just do its thing? Um, let's see. Yep, it just fills it up. Okay. There we go. That's easy enough. Okay, so um, I think I'm going to leave the fuel tank out here and maybe just park it. Well, I don't want to park it directly in front of this because we got to come and get this, you know, and fill it up at nighttime. I wonder if I should run lines all the way out here that would be a long run i mean we could do it but technically uh, or in the real world that little pump probably couldn't handle this distance effectively uh all right well for now let's just um let's just park it over here We'll just put it right there. That'll work. Um, oh, uh, wait a minute. Why can't... Oh, there we go. Okay, I was going to say, why can't I undo that? And we could probably just leave the pickup here, too. So this should be full. Yep, that's full. And that's full. It is 9 o'clock in the morning. We have 67.8 ounces of gold. So it is time to get digging. So I will bring you guys back uh, with an update uh, later on today with where we are on our progress. All right, guys, I'm back. I uh, just got the message that my mobile generator cooler has been destroyed so let's uh take a look and see what that's all about i'm gonna take the bucket and park it over here mobile generator cooler let's turn this off Turn that off so we don't burn it up. And it's this piece right here, it looks like. Okay, so let's um, inspect. Mobile generator cooler currently, dur current durability equals one. Okay, so uh, how do we take that off? Probably with the screwdriver maybe crowbar pipe wrench hammer uh impact driver none of that stuff takes it off okay let's take a look at the dig tube then see if we can figure this one out uh all right mobile no, we don't want accessories. We want, um, what is it? Spare parts. 
Mobile generator cooler repair. Oh, it is the screwdriver. We have to hit it from this side. I got you. Okay. Very cool. Okay. So, um, we got to get on this side. Let's crouch down here. And the screwdriver is number five. Unscrew. And then, wasn't there, wasn't there two screws? No, unscrew. I thought there was two, maybe not though. Well, where the hell's the other screw at? So when I look at that, it says unscrew, which I did. But I don't see another screw on there. Oh, okay. I think it's, yeah, there it is. Okay. It's a little bracket in there. I just couldn't see it very well. All right. Well, uh, I guess we're going to town. We might as well stop and check our, our prices. Am I forgetting anything? We turned that off. Uh, the generator's turned off. I don't think we actually need to take that with us, but we will anyway. Uh, this is unhitched. So let's stop and uh, check the prices. Uh, well, we might as well. We have to go to town anyway, so we might as well just do that at the bank. So I'll see you guys um, at the bank. Okay, let's see what we got here. Eleven ninety. That is not enough. All right, let's go to the park shop and get our. Mobile generator cooler thingy. We're going to pick up the other bad one and throw it next to this. This is going to be where all of our crap goes. Because they'll recycle it someday. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> Alright. Mobile generator cooler. Where are we going to find that? Water pump filter... Mobile generator cooler. Reinforced. Nah, we're not buying the reinforced stuff right now. We don't, uh, uh, I mean, we could afford it, but we start doing that left and right, and then our money's not going to, not going to build up quickly enough. All right, you in there? Yep. Okay, let's go back and fix our mobile generator. All right, let's grab this sucker. Plop it down um, here. Get our screwdriver out and put her back together. This is so fun. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Okay. Uh, pick you up, put you back right about here-ish, and get everything plugged back in. I think that's all we got to plug in. I think we're good to go. All right, let's top uh, off the fuel in this. I'm going to get grab the other... No, actually, I'm going to keep that jerry can in the truck for the pump that we have to use at night. Okay, we should be ready to get back at it. So you are at 85. All right. Okay, so we are working on 
This little side right here. Up a little more. All right, guys. Well, um, barring any more equipment breakdowns, uh, I will bring you guys back with an update in a little while. We are at uh, 67.8 ounces of gold right at the moment all right guys we are back and just about ready to finish up for the night so a couple more scoops here how to do the trick Bring that up over here down a little bit and okay so we have a full pail of gold let's turn this off and then just make sure the hopper's full for when we start up in the morning. We have 47, so yeah, a couple more scoops how to do it. Grab this. Close that up a little bit. Ninety-seven. You know what? That's close enough. Because uh, anything more that, that we do is going to just kind of waste it anyway. So let's just park the bucket right there, turn the lights off, and shut the rig down. Okay, and we'll grab our final bucket of gold for the day. Put it in the magnetite separator. Turn that sucker on. Um... I decided to disconnect the hose from this until I was using it just to save a little bit of water. I don't know how m big of a deal that makes. It probably does make a bit of the, a big deal, and actually, the more I think about it. So, uh, this little coupler thing has a switch on it here, but I, or a, yeah, a valve, but I can't seem to turn it. And nor can I turn the valve on this because that would have been the better thing. Uh, but for whatever reason, it doesn't uh, doesn't seem to work. Okay, so let's. Uh, connect the hose here. There we go. And we'll turn this on. And put the gold in. We're at uh, 83.9. I haven't, uh, I don't think I've gotten a single nugget today. So the whole entire day, no nuggets. Which is a good thing and a bad thing. It's definitely, you know, I've, I mentioned this a couple episodes ago, I think. I don't think it's OP anymore. Um, not at all, in fact. Okay, so we ended up with 86.5 uh, ounces of gold today. Not too bad. Uh, not too bad. So, all right, let's see. What do we need to do to finish up the day? We've got everything turned off. Let's uh, top you off. I just had to f actually fill that thing up. Uh, right before we were done for the night. So let's just top you off. Okay. It's nice having this um, tank here. How many jerry cans does it take to fill this up? Let's take a look. Wait, what? Yeah, that's a... You know, the funny thing is, is that gas tank doesn't look any bigger than that one, but... It obviously has quite a bit more capacity. But I think it's a little easier just running this over here than trying to hitch everything up and drive it back it over there. And We'll just do it this way. And then after that, we're going to go check the gold prices. And let's see, as far as our... Oh, yeah, we got to go uh, haul our water over there, too. I keep forgetting to hit that. It probably would behoove me to run a line all the way over here from the creek, I think. 92%. That's pretty close. Eh, what the hell. Let's just top it off. If we're going to do it, let's do it right. And just a little bit more. Okay. 
top this guy off here. Whoop. Don't get dirt in the gas nozzle. All right, so everything's uh, fueled up on this end of things. Um, so in order for me to run a line all the way over here from, well, see, the thing is, is I don't know if that pump can handle that, the little pump, all you know, all this distance. I just, I, I don't think it, whoops, what am I doing with that? I don't think it would in real life, you know. Here, let's put this bucket back. And we'll put this one back too so I don't forget. So, you know, the pressure is on, so my guess is that that probably wouldn't work. So, you know what? Let's just take this over there. It's free water. Cuz otherwise I got to pay a thousand bucks to fill this sucker up and I don't want to do that. Uh, all right, why are you not Oh, it's I'm probably just a little bit too far away from the hitch, I'm guessing. All right. And it. Huh. Oh, somebody wants to work for us. Nice. Okay. We'll have to check that out. Uh, where? There we go. Okay. Let's drive this on over to get it filled up for the morning. And we'll see who wants to work for us. Hopefully it's an excavator operator. Because then I'll bring my small excavator back over here and assign the new guy to that. <laughs> oh, whoopsie. Uh, all right, so we want to grab this pipe here, bring it around to the intake. Oh, that's right. I keep forgetting. I got to unhitch this. Okay. And this is fully fueled, so let's turn it on and start filling up our water tank and we'll just leave this here all night uh, no that's not what I wanted to do okay, let's go check who this is that wants to work for us and we'll also check the gold price you are running right yeah just can't hear it until I get really close. Okay, gold price first. Eleven ninety one. Um doesn't look like it got up to twelve at all today. Uh, well it definitely didn't get up to twelve today. Okay, so we'll just keep going and and waiting. This is a mechanic. Uh So I don't know how a mechanic actually works. I mean, you would surely you don't assign him to just one piece of equipment. But you know what we're going to do? We're not going to reject him or hire him and fire him. We're just going to leave him in the queue because maybe later on, you know, we might want to do something with him. But it looks like he's the only one that's available to us right now. Uh, okay, so let's back out of that. And we already looked at the prices. They're not any good. So... Uh, we are done for the day. So we'll just have to wait. Let that sucker fill up. And time for us to go to sleep. I don't think I need to go to town for anything tomorrow that I can think of off the top of my head. Um, oh, you know what? I forgot to disconnect the wavetable hose, but hopefully I'll remember to do that tomorrow. Uh, all right, let's sleep. It's a foggy, foggy morning. And we pulled in 18.71 ounces yesterday. Uh, that was for the whole day. Not because, again, I didn't get any nuggets at all yesterday. So not the best day, but, you know, it uh, it's a living, right? It is a living. All 
All right, guys. Well, I'm going to let you go here and um, do the same old thing. Uh, this should be full. Yep, it is full. And uh, so I'm going to hold it back over there, get it hooked up, and have another day of digging in the dirt. And hopefully we'll luck out and get a nugget today, too. Uh, but we are at 80.9 ounces. And um, we're just sitting on that, you know, until that price goes up. And then we're going to make ourselves a nice little chunk of change. So, guys, that is it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share the video. And we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.